Edo, why Obaseki is yet to form his cabinet, Idahosa explains. Hello, my wonderful people. A very warm big thank you to every one of you out there. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Subscribe if this is your first time. God bless you. Chief Charles Idahosa, former commissioner for information in Edo State and a chieftain of the People Democratic Party, PDP, in an interview spoke, among other things, the poli politics of Edo and the victory of Governor Gordon Obaseki at the Federal High Court in Abuja in the certificate forgery case brought against him by the All Progressive Congress, APC. His take on the Federal High Court Abuja dismissal of the certificate forgery suit filed against Governor Gordon Obaseki by the APC. I am not a lawyer, but as a layman, I know all the while that there was nothing in the case and it was very flimsy. I wasn't expecting any surprise. I want to congratulate Governor Gordon Obaseki, the People Democratic Party, especially the good people of Edo State. I also want to congratulate the judiciary for standing by the side of justice. Oshomole is the cause of all the problem and tension in Edo State, I can tell you. During the governorship election, he was bragging that Obaseki will not be re-elected that he was going to use federal might to remove him from office. A lot of people fail and fall for that. And at the end of the day, over 42 persons resigned from Obaseki's cabinet few days to the election. It was very important that the Edo people now know that Oshomole, who he really is, after serving as a governor for eight years and being the national chairman of APC, he still wants to hang on to power by directing those who occupy the position after he has occupied that same position. Is that fair? I think our people have learned their lesson. Oshomole has distracted Obaseki enough. We thank the Lord. We thank God really for the judgment that have proven that the governor once went to proper school. All his certificates are genuine, at least. Obaseki can now really focus and do the right thing for Edo people. Do right by Edo on the judgment of a, of a Bini High Court nullifying the candidacy of APC Deputy Governorship Candidate Ghani Abdu and what is portion for the PDP in Edo State. It was clear as daylight that the ticket was faulty. We all know that the attempts made by their counsel, they transferred the case from Bini High Court to Abuja. They brought it back. They said the judge was that was handling it in Abuja was too close to Wike. They transfer it again to Chief George. <clears throat> they used all kinds of delay tactics so that they could partake in the election. Now, the election is over and they have been humiliated even after the election is over. They have no candidate. The people that nominated them, there is, there is a court judgment that their secretariat was illegal. I don't see any victory there. The struggle is over. And let's not forget, Governor Gordon Obaseki beat them with over 88,000 votes. On comments that Obaseki is yet to constitute his cabinet because of internal crisis in the PDP. There is no crisis whatsoever. Just look at the time he constituted his cabinet in his first tenure. There was there any crisis then? You see, people just want to create problem from nothing. There is nothing going on. There is no, there is no crisis anywhere. APC said he or Baseki was not good enough. This man, a man that they chased away, has served us for four years. We all saw it. Hence, Edo voted for him. But he went to PDP and, we gra and, he, and he was grateful to PDP. Within a short time, their internal mechanism was... Put down, you see, Obaseki was what would have made the Edo State APC stand. Ushomole did not allow it. They are all about four fundamentals as parents. They are ready for the ticket. We came, we saw the, the viability of Obaseki, and we gave him the ticket without any election. All stepped down. Do you think that is a mistake? No. We looked at it very well, and we saw that this man was a man we can stand with. There is no problem. He's just taking his time to do the right 
thing by the people. There are a lot of things that he wants to make note to the media and putting things together in government is very important. A dose state is expectant and we have to deliver. Before forming a cabinet, there need to be orderliness. Things have to be done well. The right people have to be chosen for the state to truly enjoy progress. Those of you that left APC for PDP, how smoothly are you going about inauguration in PDP? Well, I will tell you the truth. It is very, everything goes on as we have planned. But you have to understand that nobody like to lose a position. By the time we came together in the PDP, we already have standing executive, such as local government, chairman, party chairman, and others. So others who have come to join will line up and work with the party. And when we left APC, we had a chairman of the party in the state. We had the local chairman, local government chairman, and they, are, and they are now nothing in the new place where they have come to belong. The people who came with us are now saying, where are we now? But guess what? That is not a problem. We are all working together for the good of Edo State. We all want to make PDP stand and stand very well in Edo State. We are still taking a look at things and things are going to straighten up really well. We won the election with cooperation. The People's Democratic Party, we are very happy. The party is back in government after 12 years. So you can see that we are working to ensure that we gain the trust of the people. So after Obaseki's tenure, whoever is coming, the people can trust the person. Some people who were world chairman turned into ordinary person and now They've lost elections, but we are working. Dialogues are being made. And as a party, we work together. Oshomole created a lot of problem within APC. We thank God that the People Democratic Party welcomed us. They gave us the umbrella when we were swept away. That is the slogan in Edo State. But at the same time, we need to negotiate terms because a lot of People Democratic Party are already working with us. But we don't want a situation where many will be desperate or we want to go after Obaseki. No, we want all hands on deck to ensure maximum victory all through. Obaseki is doing well for the people of Edo State, and we are ready to take the state even further. So my people, that is it. Said Obaseki is taking his time to ensure the best for Edo State. What do you think? What do you think? Leave us a comment. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless you. Bye for now.